Hello welcome to Objective Question Answer MCQ's YouTube channel. With a positive vibes let's start this video. Question number 1. Like charges. Option A always repel each other. Option B always attract each other. Option C can repel or attract each other depending on conditions. Option D can repel or attract each other depending on the quantity of charge. The right answer is option A. Always repel each other. Like charges always repel each other. Question number 2. The outermost layer of Earth is called Option A Crest Option B Core Option C Mantle Option D Mountain The right answer is Option A Crest The outermost layer of Earth is called Crest Question number 3 a body can be charged by Option A rubbing it against another body Option B touching it to a charged body Option C bringing a charged body near it Option D All of the above methods The right answer is Option D All of the above methods a body can be charged by all of the above given methods. Question number 4. Which of the following is not a natural phenomenon? Option A cyclone. Option B cooking. Option C lightning. Option D earthquake. The right answer is option B cooking. Among the following, cooking is not a natural phenomenon. Question number 5. The two bodies are rubbed against each other. Option A. They acquire equal and similar charges. Option B. They acquire equal and opposite charges. Option C. They acquire unequal and similar charges. Option D. They acquire unequal and opposite charges. The right answer is option B. They acquire equal and opposite charges. When the two bodies are rubbed against each other, they acquire equal and opposite charges. Question number 6. Which of the following natural phenomenon is most destructive in terms of loss of life and property? Option A. Earthquake. Option B. Winds. Option C. Lightning. Option D. Storms. The right answer is option A. Earthquake. Among the following natural phenomenon, earthquake is most destructive in terms of loss of life and property. Question number 7. The gold leaf electroscope can be used to Option A. Detect charge only. Option B. Detect and measure charge only. Option C. Detect measure and find the nature of charge option d none of the above the right answer is option c detect measure and find the nature of charge the gold leaf electroscope can be used to detect measure and find the nature of charge 
Question number 8. Lightning is, dash, on huge scale. Option A electromagnetic effect. Option B magnetic effect. Option C electric spark. Option D heating effect. The right answer is option C. Heating effect. Lightning is heating effect on huge scale. Question number 9. Electric charge can flow through. Option A insulators. Option B. Both insulators and conductors. Option C conductors. Option D. Neither insulators nor conductors. The right answer is option C. Conductors. Electric charge can flow through conductors. Question number 10. Unlike charges. Option A repels each other. Option B repel in same direction. Option C attract each other. Option D attract in same direction. The right answer is option C. Attract each other. Unlike charges attract each other. Question number 11. Lightning conductor is A. Option A piece of wire with spikes through which current can flow. Option B substance that can be charged by clouds. Option C metal rod with spikes, ending in a copper plate buried in the ground, fixed to building to protect it from lightning. Option D copper plate buried in the ground below a building to protect it from lightning. The right answer is option C. Metal rod with spikes, ending in a copper plate buried in the ground, fixed to building to protect it from lightning. Lightning conductor is a metal rod with spikes, ending in a copper plate buried in the ground, fixed to building to protect it from lightning. Question number 12. Building can be protected from lightning by using Option A lightning rod at the top of building Option B wooden logs at the top of building Option C lightning rod on the levels of building Option D All of these The right answer is option A Lightning rod at the top of building. Building can be protected from lightning by using lightning rod at the top of building. Question number 13. To test if a body is charged or not you will use. Option A. Another unchanged arced body. Option B. A negatively charged body. Option C. A positively charged body. Option D. A positively and a negatively charged body. The right answer is option D. A positively and a negatively charged body. To test if a body is charged or not you will use a positively and a negatively charged body. Question number 14. Some object can be charged by, dash, with other objects. Option A rubbing. Option B joining. Option C heating. Option D touching. The right answer is option A. Rubbing. Some object can be charged by rubbing with other objects. 
Question number 15. You are given an unchanged arc electroscope and a charged body. No other apparatus is allowed. You can use the electroscope to Option A. Only detect the charge. Option B. Detect and measure the charge. Option C. Detect, measure and find the nature of the charge. Option D. Neither of these since the electroscope is unchanged argued. The right answer is option C. Detect, measure and find the nature of the charge. You can use the electroscope to detect, measure and find the nature of the charge. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel Objective Question Answer MCQs. And always remember, never stops learning, because life never stops teaching.